In front of the club. <laughs> Hi there, everybody. Welcome back. I'm the Missing Sock. Welcome back for more Grand Theft Auto Online news. <laughs> Happy New Year, everybody. Woo. Yeah. Oh. You might want to grab yourself an atomizer. Uh, or not. <laughs> yeah, dust that off. There we go. <laughs> so, anyway, I'll put that away for the moment. And oh, maybe we'll do some fireworks. Because it's a Friday morning. Yeah, so happy Friday, everybody. It's Friday in real life. And it's almost morning, so we better fire, set off our fireworks now. Happy New Year. Woohoo. Here's to a brand new year. Filled with awesomeness. <laughs> hey, one more? One more. <laughs> All right. So you guys might want to visit Ammunition before it's too late. Um, they, uh, the fireworks and stuff will be probably disappearing soon. Now, it might be January 14th, but my guess would be it's actually going to be January 7th. So next week's Tuesday, we'll start a new event week. So on Monday, a lot of this stuff will be its last day. So yeah, on Tuesday, a lot of this stuff will probably disappear. Now I say probably because I can't speak for Rockstar. It might go on for another week, but chances are, I believe, on uh, on this coming Tuesday, all this holiday gear like my hat and uh, and the fireworks are going to disappear from the stores. Now thankfully, a lot of the, th the things that you've unlocked, any gift, any uh, pardon me, any gift sweaters, um, gift unlocks, and things like your fireworks, like I'm holding right now will uh, stay unlocked for you. So you might want to actually stock up on your uh, fireworks and that way you've got them throughout the uh, next few months until they give us some more again. I think it might not be uh, might be all the way till Ind Independence Day before we get any more fireworks again. And another latest news is the Atomizer, which I got right here. So the Atomizer is, uh, well, it was free on Christmas Day um, and you could also unlock it through the uh, business battles, the event cargo, but otherwise you can now buy an ammunition for 399,000. Now, I was trying to see if the event cargo uh, business battles are still on the go for this weekend. You guys can keep your eye open for that. I couldn't get a straight answer. I couldn't find any answers. And, and in any of the sessions I was in, there was only regular business battles. So it might already be done with that. But that said, the event, the festive event, um, if you see event cargo business battles show up, um, you might want to do those if they are still running at all. And, uh, you know, there's, there's holiday sweaters to unlock. But otherwise, there is a chance you could unlock the atomizer. You can also unlock the uh, the, um, the livery that I have right here, which is just a festive green livery. But it does make it glow, I think, compared to the other ones. Yeah. So, something, uh, some new news for the Friday update. I thought we'd do a news uh, update. There was no news this week because it's the same news specials that we already covered on our last Tuesday uh, episode. Um, so there is uh, still double money this week on uh, CEO Cargo, and that's probably one of the best ways of making money. So on a large crate warehouse, it would be normally full $2.2 million payout. I'm not counting any other bonuses or anything. And right now it would be $4.4 million. So that's just crazy. Uh, and I would also suggest that uh, come this Monday night, depending on where you are in the world, um, you might want to sell whatever cargo you have, even if it's not a full warehouse, because the double money will still make you more profit than usually than holding on to it. So, yeah. And I've been working on uh, filling up our cargo warehouse, so hopefully we can fit it into another laid-back grinding episode coming up too. And uh, we haven't done much in the way of cargo warehouses because it takes so long to fill them up. Uh, so now we've got one, and hopefully we can do that while it's still double money. So that's one of the best ways of making money right now. And of course, the bunkers are the other better way, a great way of making money this week. Uh, the bunker sales are double money as well. And the biker contracts in your biker clubhouse uh, boardroom are also double money. And the best missions there, you know, depending, like, uh, they're all, a lot of the really great missions there, actually. Um, but the best ones, generally speaking, for time, um, for solo players, would be uh, POW and Jailbreak. And if you have another biker to help you, guns for hire. Yeah, so great missions. And there's also double money in the arena still, the arena war, any of the arena war um, uh, battles, and uh, as well the uh, the uh, air cargo hangar. So if you want to empty out your uh, your hangar as well, it might be a good time to do that too. Let's head inside. Into the glove. So that I'd have on my festive gear one more time. <laughs> got all my gifts throughout the holidays, a bunch of unlocked sweaters. Yeah, it's pretty cool. A lot of cool uh, sweaters we got throughout this holiday. Uh, I was a little disappointed. Hey. I was a little disappointed that there was no um, uh, regular t-shirts though. Hey Marcel. Hey there, boss. But uh, yeah, the, you know, some of you guys noticed some of the other t-shirts I have and wondered how I got them. Well, some of them were, uh, were on New Year's and Christmas in the past. And unfortunately this year, they didn't seem to give us any. Let's go out a New Year's drink for you guys. <laughs> Club's still hopping, hopping away. All through the holidays, never stopped. <laughs> 
Yeah, so I thought I'd do a business update, say Happy New Year to you guys, and uh, remind you that those specials are still on the go until January 7th. Um, I think there's actually, uh, I think the Arena War actually has some stuff that goes past that till the 14th. But either way, all we can count on is till January 7th, this Monday. So this weekend is the last weekend for these double money for the cargo warehouses and all those kinds of things as well. Yep. And the Atomizer now being in store is being is the new news for only 399000 <laughs> Hey. All right. And we've got some more uh, episodes coming up, regular episodes. We've got our click all done, so that'll be coming up probably shortly after this uh, news up episode. Let's have our Richards to start off. Yeah, nice Richards whiskey for the new year. Thank you. Good choice. Mm-hmm. So happy new year, everybody. Thanks for being here. Here's to our last year, 2018. Woo, thanks to you guys. <laughs> All right. Yeah, there we go. Now we're feeling it. We're feeling you know, the festive vibe again. <laughs> All right, another one. Drink there, boss. We'll try for the Macbeth. Maybe one more gift for the holidays. Maybe one more try for the uh, yeah, for the Keith Lom T-shirt. Go for the last drink of the night. <laughs> All right, now this one's to you guys again. <laughs> so uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. That really helps us out. It's free. <laughs> and here's to the new year, 2019. Oh, oh. New Year! Woo! <laughs> Thanks, everybody. <laughs> hey, walk it off a little, boss. Yeah, might be a good idea. Maybe, maybe we'll go. Maybe we'll go find a nice spot around behind the bar. Oh, hey, look at the Christmas tree. <laughs> yeah, so I think a lot of these decorations will all be disappearing. Oh, oh, oh! Don't get any on the sweater. <laughs> That's rough. Same as last year. <laughs> How's it going? Uh, well, rough, but you know, good start of the year. Great start. <laughs> Go another tip. Get my Gepsilon robes one of these days. <laughs> All right, everybody. And uh, there's still double money in the clubs too. So um, uh, for the uh, club uh, payouts, so instead of ten thousand, up to ten thousand anyway, it's twenty thousand that'll appear in your uh, in your where in your um, uh, wall safe. So that's kind of good right now. And uh, like I've said before, I do the lazy way of keeping your uh, your popularity bar up by just changing um, uh, DJs, and it's easier to do that on the second floor. It might not look like it, but I'm busy. Yeah, no, it totally looks like it, Tony. <laughs> Things are going well down there, kid. Good, good. Happy New Year, Tony. <laughs> All right, yeah, phone call for money, you mean? <laughs> All right, one more, one more. Wash off that taste. <laughs> Woo. So I hope you guys had a happy holidays. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. And we'll see you guys back here for more regular news, I imagine, on Tuesday, um, January 7th, 8th, depending on where you are. And uh, for our regular episodes. So I'll we'll have the Vapid Click coming out and some of the other ones and some other stuff too. So we've talked about the, uh, the Grand Trismo R that I got for an early Christmas present just at the end of last week's sale. Or, well, the Christmas Eve sale, I guess it would be, before the, the current uh, events are, are on and uh, B-21 uh, Strike Force, and uh, some others too, and Insurgent Pickup, yeah. So, yeah, all kinds of stuff, plus some other things. <laughs> An oppressor, yeah. Woo! Happy holidays, everybody. Take care. Maybe we'll go back into the cadet. Let's try twice, why not? I'm feeling lucky. <laughs> Hey. What's up, boss? Get you something? Uh, you know, yeah, let's try over See here. See you soon, boss. Maybe, uh, maybe we'll get better luck at this bar. <laughs> hey. How you doing? Must be quieter on this side. Macbeth. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. Bring her up, bring her up. All right, to all the new things. Perfect. So that wasn't so hard. Went down easy. No problems. Maybe avoid the stairs. Yeah, maybe. Maybe we'll just hang chill right here. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least they don't leave me there. Somebody drags me off.
Probably the bartenders. <laughs> but then you got to wonder where you end up and how you end up in some of these places. Oh, we're loading for a while. I got a feeling we had a long night. Oh, yeah. <laughs> whoa. Whoa. Oh, well, we're, uh, we're at the club. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Take care, everybody. Uh, better put the van away. Oh, and the atomizer? I definitely recommend the atomizer. If you can afford it. If you didn't get it unlocked. Yeah. My, it's a it's an awesome tool. My my in my opinion, it's the best um, the best tool. Like I would call it a tool for for fixing your cell vehicles. So if this was your cell vehicle and it got stuck somewhere, as it often happens to a lot of us, you know, they can get uh, stuck on uh, barriers and, and uh, tires and rocks and all kinds of things. And they usually don't give you much time with a cell vehicle from your bunker, from your MC business, or things like that. Usually they uh, they self destruct pretty quickly. You know, it feels like within 30 seconds or so. So with something like this, you can instantly just pull it out. You can always obviously hit the, the vehicle, but you can also hit just around it. And it doesn't do a lot of damage, but it does knock things free. So we'll try it on this unfortunate silver guy right here. So we'll just hit it right beside it. And it'll just knock your vehicle free. So very useful. As a weapon, it actually will kill people just by throwing them around and ragdolling them. Oh, missed him. He's lucky. <laughs> but... Uh, if you ask me, you know, it, it's more, it's better as a distraction, you know, if, if one of these guys was trying to, like, you know, you picture an oppressor or something trying to get us, it makes it very hard for them to aim at you and stay on target or even fly if they're in range, um, if you're hitting them with things like this. So you can imagine how that would be hard to hit somebody or hurt somebody when they're doing that to you. Yeah. So, a very good tool. I definitely recommend it. I don't know if it's worth 399000 but... Then again, though, when you get your cell vehicle stuck, you'll be happy to have one. I better get the van inside. <laughs> oh, <shit. Whoop. laughs> Weasel News complains when I'm part of the news, so I try to not let them find out. <laughs> Take care, everybody. And a Happy New Year.